know what's going on YouTube. It's a Slytherin Evil Viper here again with another Warframe video. But today is going to be a bit different. Today I'm going to do my top 5 primary weapons. The weapons that I actually like a lot. First, to start off is with the Amprex. Such a lovely weapon in my opinion. Just gonna spawn in three of them. And we will get this going. It's such a good armor right there. You just gotta love the Amprex. It doesn't need a ribbon mod, but it would be really nice to have one on that. Such a good weapon if you want to strip armor fast. But I say, if you're going to do that, you may, like, on a higher level, you may want, like, a secondary that has viral, but a good status chance to proc that viral. And also, it should be a flash based weapon. So you can, you know, get rid of them a bit quicker. Or you could, since it'll be clone. Flash, I, I'm pretty sure heat will work. But I say just in case you might want to have a viral and flash build to just get rid of them a bit quicker. Okay, coming in number two is the Lanka. Now this weapon right here, this weapon impacts a bit, well I wouldn't say a bit, but it packs a pretty big punch. Especially if you're going Eilon hunting with it. That's pretty much the best sniper in my opinion. Well probably besides the Rubico Prime. The Rubico Prime can I see how hard it hits and I'm like wow, that's impressive. And that plus two I got man, I love it. I'll spawn in more just to show that off again. Okay, so we're gonna be a bit further. Of course, this is a near ribbon. I have ribbon for it, but that was like a month ago. So I don't know how long exactly, but it was definitely some time ago. And I sold it for 250 but I felt like I should have either kept it or I sold it a bit more, considering that the weapon is really good. I don't know. I'm not good with pricing. And come in number three. Gonna be a bit of a surprise. Is the dread the first bow? Well, I wouldn't say the first bow, but the first powerful bow that I started using. I put five formas on it, and I don't know why I just grabbed energy, but it's definitely my favorite bow. Hits pretty hard. I would love to get a ribbon for it. That was a weird reload. Oh, the target behind that fella, well, woman, died. Yeah, that that's pretty nice. I gotta admit, the one thing that I love about the dread is that it decapitates it could split your enemies in half and stuff that's such a good feature I'm like dang stalker your bow is something else yeah, I'm impressed okay come in at number four still gonna be a bit of fun this is Paris Prime 
it's just, I don't know what it is about it, but it is fun to use. It's actually more fun than the Cernos Prime. I recently got that. It's pretty fun to me. The one in the middle died already. That's interesting. It's like, dang, you were taking a bit more damage. It may not be as good as, like, the dread, but still pretty fun to use. Okay, this one is one of my favorites. Last but not least, the Super Vandal. And obviously, it, we're, we're going to, you know, put some more enemies in. We're going to put eight this time. I mean, it has a recoil on it. But you can see, we took all of them out with only one clip. Because obviously the clip is 300, that, that's a lot of bullets. And the fire rate is insane. When I first got this, I think it was from, yeah, Borrow Key, I was so excited. And, um, since there's an MR-14 weapon, at the very last moment, like, I think Borrow was getting ready to leave next day, and I had to grind so hard to get it, because I was like, MR13, but I wasn't, I think I was like halfway through MR13, or just a little bit more than halfway, and I was like, holy crap, I need to hurry up, because I know this weapon won't return for so long, and I have to get it, because when I first saw the Super Vandal, um, let's see, I think... Ah, yeah, I remember this streamer that I really like a lot. He's pretty cool in my opinion. Named Gridark. He, I saw him using. I was like, oh, this weapon looks interesting. And this bit more back where I didn't know what I was doing. But it's just like over time, you really realize what you're doing. And you know what to do. You know how to mod things. You know, you get better over time. But yeah, love this weapon. Especially if you want to like use it with like Mirage Prime or just Mirage Varian, Rhino. Well, Harlow E kind of—he, I would say that's kind of like cheating in a way, you know, because of Covenant. But then again, that is a Warframe buff, so. I just see it's kind of cheating by going around the system, especially if a weapon doesn't have very high crit. But I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Like, share, subscribe, and join the evil side.